What's up guys, today I got a brand new video as you can tell we've got the brand new Montezuma 36 by 17 shot box and today we're going to be taking a look at it. We just unboxed it so you guys will get to see it when I do. So let's get started. All right guys, like I mentioned in the intro, we got the brand new Montezuma shot box in here. It is 36 inches long, 17 inches deep, and this thing has a ton of storage in it. I'm a super huge fan of Montezuma, that's no uh, secret. Um, I've got it in my service truck. I believe it's the best toolbox for the money as far as footprint versus the amount of tools that they'll hold. If you haven't checked out the video on the Montezuma box. I'll put a link at the top. Be sure to check that out and you can see the space savings that these boxes offer. You can pack an incredible amount of tools in a very small space with these and the one that I have in my service truck is fully weatherproof where this one is a shop box. It's designed to use in a shop so it's not weatherproof. But this is a great alternative for you guys that are looking for a space saving solution to have tools in a shop or a small garage or frankly just don't want to have a lot of room tied up for a toolbox. So let's take a look at this thing. The part number on it is a SB360DB and it is made by Montezuma and it has a full five year warranty on it. So let's take a look inside the box. I like the way they did the handle design on these. It's a a half turn, quarter turn, and the box opens. As you can see, it's supported by a shock here. And all of this up here is for your wrenches. This box is big enough to hold all your standard and your metric stuff in one box. They simply slide over the pegs and they'll hang down behind here. And all of these are for your sockets. As you can see, half inch sockets, three eighth sockets, and quarter inch sockets. So you'll be able to hold a ton of sockets in this box. And what's cool about this box versus the other boxes, <clears throat> like for the service truck model, they give you storage as well as grommets to run your power cords through. So you can actually store your power tools in here as well as charge them all in one box. And the way this works, they fit in here extremely nice. And you can see they're going to lock in in that groove and they're, they're there. I mean, it's really nice design. It's easy to get in and out. No matter which side you decide to put them on, they'll hold the larger 18 volt stuff. They go in and kind of lock in at an angle. As you can see, the battery's actually sitting on the bottom and it's in there nice. They're gonna hold it well. Also, if you've got the 14-4 stuff, like the snap-on, you can hang it upside down, or you can hang it like the regular power tools. But what's cool is this box has so many different features in it that you can kind of customize it the way that you want it to be used. If you wanna put your chargers down here, chargers up here, they have the cutouts for the cords to run through everything. They've got the other grommet here. So it's really nice. So if you wanted to put your charger here, you can run your grommet through the side or what's really cool, this section opens up and you can see this is a very large area in here. You know, it's that deep that you can use for any other storage, or you can put your chargers down here. They've got the cutouts that allow for that. You can just simply run them down behind here 
and you've got your chargers back there if that's where you want to put them. And another awesome feature, one thing you will notice, the shocks are extremely strong when you go to push it down mm. because they don't have tools on it. They're made to kind of support the weight of the tools. But it has an extremely large drawer. So you'll be able to put all your pry bars, hammers, larger wrenches, adjustable wrenches, puller sets, whatever you need to put, this drawer is big enough to allow for that. This box has got a ton of awesome features that's going to save you a lot of room in your shop. Just by having the 36 by 17 footprint, it's going to allow you to put this box pretty much anywhere that you're gonna to need to. Uh, the box is about 120 pounds empty, so it's a very heavy duty construction that's in this box. You know, it's got a powder coat finish. It's the same finish as on the, the normal boxes that they sell, and that's held up extremely well for our use. I have zero complaints at all um, with Montezuma. Their quality is excellent. I feel like they make the best truck boxes on the market today, especially for the money. This box runs $499, and you can find them online. Uh, <laughs> I'm super excited about this box. You know, I was looking for a more compact box to put on the other side of the shop to load down with tools so you don't have to walk back and forth. And I believe this is the perfect box for that. You know, you could set this on a, on a, on a roll card or whatever you want to do. My plan is just to put it on a workbench, and that way we'll have it kind of separated from everybody else, you know, in case you need something kind of quick. I'm gonna put everything in here as far as impact sockets and wrenches and just pretty much deck it out with your normal tools. Um, having the ability to store stuff under here as well as in the drawer, you know, it really makes this box very versatile, you know, to use for pretty much anything that you wanna store in it tool-wise. But we'll be doing a follow-up video once we get this box loaded down. That way you can see the amount of tools that it will hold in it. Um, it's really going to surprise a lot of you guys that's not familiar with Montezuma and how their layout is on their boxes with the pegs and the, you know, the pegs for the wrenches. Now that they've added this, this with the power tool storage as well as the cubby hole under here and the drawer, this box is going to hold an incredible amount of tools. It's really going to shock you guys. So you guys be watching for that video. And uh, we're going to load this thing down. I'm super stoked about it, but I wanted to bring it to your guys' attention because I know a lot of y'all have been asking about the Montezuma box that I have in my truck, and I absolutely love it. And the shop box is going to be an awesome addition to, to the shop here as well. But like always, guys, check out these Montezuma boxes. If you haven't looked at them, take the time and look. There'll be a card at the end of the video that shows kind of what's in my service truck as far as my Montezuma box. Like always, thanks for watching. If you like this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up and click that subscribe button. It's free. It never costs you guys a dime. Y'all have a great one, and we will catch y'all next time. See ya.